Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. We give God all the glory. Let God be praised forever in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, child of God. Jesus loves you. And I love you. Please family like this video. Share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. They made up story against this person. They want you to look like the bad person. <clears throat> they want you to look like the bad person. Stories were made up against you. Stories, I say again, was made up against you by the same people that hurt you. By the same people that hurt you. That is why, you know, that is how they try to cover up their wickedness. That is how they try to cover up their wickedness. But child of God, do not worry. Because even after all the story that they made against you, God said, I should tell you, that in that land where they stand to spoil your name, that you will stand tall and you will grow. Hallelujah. You will stand tall, you will stand tall, you will grow. When I mean stand tall, you will excel. You will excel. The story was for them to make sure you fall. The story that was made up against you. Why they turned, they wanted to flip the script on you. They flip the script self. It's not that they wanted this. They flip the script. They flip the script. It is for them to, uh, they, they wanted to do that to uproot you. To uproot you from your ground. Uproot you from your ground. But hear me very well. Whosoever the Lord has planted his foot on a solid ground. The Bible said Christ is the solid rock that we stand. All of that rock they are seeking sand. Christ is our solid rock that we stand. Every other rock they are seeking sand. Hallelujah, child of God. Hear me very well. They made up different kinds of story to make sure they uproot you from your ground. But rather for you to be uprooted, they see that you are even more rooted. You are even more rooted. Why? Because it is God that plants you. So no man can uproot what God has planted. It is just like when God opened the door, no man can close it. Hallelujah. The Bible says the key is in his hands. The keys of life and death, the keys of whatever, the key of silver and gold, everything, he is in the hands of God. So when God gives you an open door, no matter how the enemy wants to bring you out from that open door and close the door, it cannot prosper. It cannot prosper. The stories that was made against you, the false accusation, they presented it so beautifully. But God is the one that sees it in the, in the secret. And he rewards in the open. Hallelujah. God sees your heart. Even in that secret place where no man is seeing you. Even in that place where no one is looking at you. God sees your heart. He knows us. He knows us by our name. Hallelujah. And that God has rooted you on a solid ground. Which is Christ. No man can approach you. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.